heard it in the chants. Silence is compliance. Whether it was my hair, the touching and the pulling and the poking, you can't run away from yourself, from your hair, from your body. You can't. You can't do anything about it. I had an experience getting pushed off the jungle gym and called the N-word. No, it continues, unfortunately, and that's why we saw the protest march. It doesn't stop at the protests, right? I really hope that people just didn't come out for that snapshot. We need you to speak up. We need to know that you're not only standing behind us and beside us, but in front of us. We need to know when we step outside our house, you're gonna defend us. How will you know that that's having an impact? What are you going to see? That's a great question. What we will see is young people feeling proud of who they are and feeling proud of their heritage. Young people that are emotionally, mentally, physically, intellectually, really robust and healthy, embracing all of who they are and not fearing how they might be perceived because they know their history, that they're proud of their history and proud of the future that is unfolding in front of them. And they can do anything they set their minds to without limitation. They say through education there's a better understanding. What we do see is that our community in Guelph could potentially be the community you want to be. Um, all these initiatives do take some funding and uh, we appreciate the support of the community.